It is more than just an invention. It is a message of a clear path towards cleaner and cheaper alternative. Electric vehicles are yet to dominate the Nigerian automobile industry. But with the high cost of fuel, more car owners are seeking alternatives to traditional petrol engines. Before President Inobu's inauguration in May 2023, a litre of petrol retail at about 12 US cents. However, upon his declaration that the subsidy was gone, the cost more than quadrupled to 58 cents, piling pressure on households and commuters alike. To help us in the country because the uh, price of petrol is too high and there's not, it's not everybody that can pay for it, that can get it. So I think it's better we should have electric vehicles that will help us. Nigeria has also been battling extreme weather as patterns continue to be linked to climate change. With over 11.8 million petrol-powered vehicles on the roads, the country is a significant contributor to global emissions. But students believe EVs could shift Nigeria toward a greener, more sustainable future. Scientists made the research and came up with the conclusion that moving forward, if care is not taken, the carbon monoxide that is emitted from the ICE, internal combustion engine, the normal car, that we drive, the smoke that is emitted from the car is going to damage the ozone layer that protects us from global warming. So this electric vehicle doesn't emit smoke, that's the carbon monoxide, and also doesn't need fuel to power it. The EV team says their work is more than engineering. It is about inspiration. From batteries to tires, the students are wiring together knowledge and ambition. My interest was to learn more about engineering, the advanced level, so I can have the knowledge in the future. And also I want other learners to be inspired by me to see that I'm also a student, but I've built an electric vehicle. I helped in coupling the wires in the electrical aspects and also fixing the tires. I took part in the electric, uh, electrical parts of the vehicle, e.g. the batteries. What sparked my interest was the need to reduce pollution, cut cost price of fuel and also for a cleaner future. These students are proving that innovation doesn't just run on fuel. It runs on vision. In Nigeria's race against rising costs and climate change, the electric vehicle is more than just a prototype. It is a spark of possibility. Yankinu, CGTN.